Talking about the other process, the TG or triethylene glycol dehydration unit, can you let yeah. us know about the process overall and how which blocks do you use? Yes, okay. Uh, in my TG glycerol uh, project, uh, I used a natural gas. Natural gas uh, that uh, first it went to a separator. Okay, separator uh, had separated the natural gas from the water. My main problem is to separate the natural gas from the water using TE glycerol. This is the, my main problem. Uh, but uh, TG, we use TEG glycerol because it, it has high quality, it is low cost also, and high performance to remove the water. You know, the natural gas will become a dry gas at 99%. This is a very good performance of the TE glycerol. The separator will want to give us this performance, okay? But we use separator uh, يعني, to, as an initial step prior to make the TEG glycerol, okay? So first thing, we'll, uh, el, um, el wet natural gas will go to the separator and uh, two-step separator and the water will be out, okay? Second step, the, the wet gas will go to absorber to be absorbed against TEG glycerol. So the dry gas will be out, and the rich gas, rich TEG glycerol, will be out. As the same problem, a rich TEG glycerol is the TEG glycerol plus impurities, or it's mainly a water. TEG glycerol plus a water. So I needed to recycle. I need to recycle it because I need to use it again. I want to throw it away. So then we will have to recycle the TEG glycerol. Okay, uh, TEG glycerol will go to the valve. Valve will reduce its pressure. And then, and then we'll go to the uh, a separator to remove the vent, uh, the flash gases or uh, the vent gases. Okay. Also, uh, it will go to the distillation column. A distillation column. It will go to the distillation column. Distillation column. Uh, the rich TG gross roll will go to the distillation column, uh, and uh, and there will be a, a clean or lean lean TG gross roll will emerge. And acid gases will emerge. Acid gas, it is the impurities or the water will, will emerge. And the rich TEG roll will be recycled back to the absorber. Okay. The recycle process, uh, we, we use the um, TEG gross roll. We'll go, we'll go first to a heat exchanger. In order, uh, TEG gross roll will go first to a heat exchanger. Okay. In order to decrease its temperature. Then, uh, it will um, we will add a, t a makeup of TE glycerol because um, in distillation column you know in distillation column when you uh, when you try to recycle the TE glycerol there are some gas will emerge we, you will have a loose in the qual quantity of TE TEG glycerol so we have to make up this quantity loses by uh, by adding addition TE glycerol. Then we will uh, we will have a pump that will increase the pressure, and we will have a cooler to decrease its temperature again after the makeup, and it will be recycled back to the absorber. Which one you had harder time to model the amine unit or the TEG yes, this unit? One, this one, dehydration. It was very hard. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I think it has a little bit more complexity. The amine is actually pretty straightforward. It's two main units and. In one you recover, and in the other you regener yeah. regenerate. Yes. And TG is a little bit more way complex than that. 